Hey, what's up, YouTube? I'm Jason, and today we're going to be talking about HKS in Japan. As of 2023, HKS is now a 50 year old company. They specialize in engineering, manufacturing, and sales of high performance aftermarket automotive parts. HKS is arguably the most well known automotive aftermarket brand in the world. The HKS headquarters is at the base of Mount Fuji. Throughout Japan, there are three sales offices, which are located in Tokyo, Nagoya, and Osaka. We're currently here at the HKS store in Tokyo. Let's walk around and see what they got. RB26 2.8 liter stroker kit. Sweet. I have one friend who has that. It's pretty crazy. Shout out to Kenny. It's oil, oil filters. That's pretty cool. Coolant, HKS spark plugs, suspension, some mufflers. Oh, wow, wow. Got your pistons. Ooh, it's more cluster for an R34. from R32, I'm not sure. More suspension. Fiber bits and pieces. Whoa, look at this. I think it's for, I think, the Civics? I'm not sure. This is like shot bars. Does anyone know what exhaust this is for? Decades, I think, maybe. This is a stroker. Ooh. That's cool to see. Motorcycles. This is the uh, get track or cheat track for the GTR. Really, really cool to see this. So, engine would go this way. Drive shaft going to the rear of the car, and another drive shaft going to the front of the car. That's how your all wheel drive set up. Ooh, check this out. That's nice. Cool motorcycle in the back. Looks like, looks like a Yamaha. Really cool RB26 right here. Oh, right. So, drive shaft goes to the front. Imagine this would be in front of the transmission. Drive shaft would connect right here. And you got your axles to make it all wheel drive on the sides or in the front of the car. That's how it looks. Really cool. Add 
Advance, T5, BBS, and his small RMG T4s, BBS LMs. Looks like the spec list for the Stroker kits. Oh, nice. HKS gear. These are hoodie? No, shirts. Yeah, shirts. Really cool. Oh, that's neat. HKS filter, but it's a it's a pillow. Cool. Container box. Oh. Filters. Little seat collection here. Oh, that's sweet. Look at those little RB26s right there. A little bit of um, desk art. These are made. Not sure. But option and oh, here you go. December 2015. Crazy. February 2014. Ooh, a little bit of dust. Oh, look at that. Active GTR. That's that carbon fiber GTO we saw at Weekfest last year. These look like really, really big, big brakes right here. Four, 400? Wow. Huge. Aha, endless. These are nice. A lot of cars here in Japan have this. Just like on street cars too. Amazing. In America, this is very expensive. I wonder, is it heavy? No, that's actually really light. Considering it's a six pot, right? Pretty light. Cool to see like that. Some more magazines. Ooh, old DVDs. Best motoring. Oh, that's so cool. Comment below if you used to watch Best Motoring. I used to watch this all the time. Let's see. 2010. Ooh. Porsche 911 Turbo. Let's see. We can find something. Cool. Now I have a GT2. Alright. It's so weird. Why am I picking the Porsches? Let's see if I can find. I remember this. I remember this uh this battle right here. You can see this on YouTube too. So oh, NSX type bar in the back, keeping up with all these cars. It doesn't, but <laughs> it's cool to see. Let's see. Oh, S2000. Yes. Really cool. This 
Dust is probably from uh, <laughs> from back then too. Oh, anybody used to watch Hot Version? I used to watch this too. That's so cool. An option? Oh man, I just realized that too. Really cool. RC drift cars. Looks like an active GTR. So I guess they're still coming out with these things. Coffee machine. Oh, I hope you guys enjoyed that tour of HKS Technical Factory here in Tokyo. If you liked this video, please hit the like button. Consider subscribing. I'll see you guys in the next one.